Ready, set, go. Good morning, Pike City Sister Ave. Ready to take the first step on your career journey? Set out on the path with hands-on career courses at the Career and STEM Center at Pike High School. Earn a license or certificate, and after graduation, it's go time. I plan to go on and be a firefighter. Uh, this is a good first step to get there. Do you have an appetite for cooking? Making everything from scratch, like literally everything from scratch. Do you keep up with the news, current events, and sports? Good morning, I'm Charlie, and this is your Red Zone Sports Update. Do you have a heart for Good. caring for others? I took this class because I have a passion for helping people, and I want to be a nurse practitioner. State of the art, hands-on, career and STEM center courses take you beyond the pages of the textbook and put you on a path to the industry of your choice. You can even earn dual credit, which means you could earn college credit with Ivy Tech Community College and Vincennes University at little or no cost to you and your family. You may earn up to three high school credits per semester in selected courses that will apply towards a high school diploma. And there are so many exciting courses to choose from to prepare you for high skill, high wage, and high demand occupations and careers. Now let's get you ready. Start by picturing your future in one of these careers. Health Science, Certified Nursing Assistant, or CNA. Cosmetology and Barbering, TV and Radio Broadcasting. Culinary Arts, Heating and Air Conditioning, or HVAC. Emergency Medical Technician, or EMT. Computer Tech Support and Computer Networking. Criminal Justice, Industrial Automation and Robotics. Now, let's get you set. We're taking you inside the classrooms for a closer look at each career pathway. But I just like caring for people and working in healthcare. The Health Science Certified Nursing Assistant, or CNA course, focuses on the duties of essential workers, those on the front lines caring for our every need. I want to be a pediatrician and I enjoy helping people who can help themselves. You'll learn how to best communicate with patients and care for patients from head to toe. Students are learning the 72 skills that adults have to learn taking the same course. So they'll learn 72 skills, they'll have theory, and they'll go out and take care of real people in the nursing home, the most fragile people with the most complex needs. The skills are common in patient nursing care, dental care, animal care, public health, health care systems, anatomy, physiology, and in medical terminology. So it could help me from my experience to become a doctor in the future. This dual credit course provides the opportunity to be a CNA. When it comes to learning basic health care skills that will lead to a rewarding career, this course is priceless. It only costs your commitment and your time and compassion. I wash hair, we curl, we cut, we do flat iron curls. There's a lot of buzz about the cosmetology and barbering course at Pike High School. We basically do, we learn everything. We do makeup, we do waxes. In this salon setting, you'll get hands-on lessons on manicures, pedicures, and techniques for the face and hair. Skills that could put you a cut above others when pursuing a job you could start primping and pampering clients as soon as you graduate. Once you um, complete the program, you'll receive a license which will allow you to go into the workforce and begin working in any beauty salon, barbershop, or spa. Cosmetology and barbering are two-year courses and dual credit. A traditional cosmetology barbering school can cost you thousands of dollars. This saves you money by taking the same program at Pike. Cosmetology and barbering are also open to the public to give students more practical experience. Good morning, Pike students and staff. My name is Evan. The morning announcements at Pike High School keep students up to date on what's happening in school, in the community, and around the world. Can you see yourself in the spotlight? Or maybe you prefer behind the scenes? In either role, you'll be part of a broadcasting team called RDTV that's responsible for lights, camera, action. Built my self-confidence, has taught me a lot of skills. You'll tap into your creative side as you produce your own videos for class projects. We get something so interesting that people would want to watch. The focus is on hey communication, guys, you media, and video. Today at the IHSAA. Topics could include news, current events, right, entertainment, even Pike sports. Interviews, games, live streams. 
You'll discover and share stories and roam the hallways and classrooms with your camera and microphone, interviewing staff and your peers. Your story might just end up on the morning announcements or even the RDTV YouTube page. You can interact with all the students at Pike and just show your creativity to the whole school. The skills that you learn in radio and television can help you in any career. And as you grow as a communicator, you might grow your confidence. Socializing with my peers and just being confident to talk to anyone around the school, such as faculty, teachers, like staff. We're turning up the heat in this classroom. If you already cook every chance you get. I like baking. Or you're not quite the chef, but want to learn. If food is your favorite topic and making a delicious meal is your idea of fun, this culinary arts course should be on your menu. My favorite thing to make in this class is desserts, cakes, cookies, brownies, and other desserts. And many of those items get featured in the Red Zone Cafe at Pike. In this course, you'll get a taste of a variety of skills to prepare you for jobs in restaurants or other cooking and food related fields but the opportunities don't end there. So not only are students learning how to cook, but they're also learning different aspects of the hospitality industry. That's right, Pike's Culinary Arts and Hospitality Program curriculum was developed by the National Restaurant Association. It prepares you for jobs and higher education programs related to the entire spectrum of careers in the hospitality industry. This program is a dual credit course and can lead to national certifications. With this well-rounded experience, you'll leave this class more seasoned than when you got here. Um, they come in feeling fairly insecure because they might not have ever cooked or even boiled water before. And when they leave here, they have a very sound, basic knowledge of the hospitality industry as well as the culinary industry. Culinary programs are open to the public to give students more practical experience. The culinary program also offers catering. The heating and air conditioning, or HVAC program, has a lot of moving parts. How to troubleshoot them, how to replace units, and how to fix each individual part. There's tons of parts in here. You'll be hands-on with equipment, learning how things should work. We uh, fixed a lot of copper tubing and sealed it together with blow torches. And the dual credit HVAC program includes laboratory experiences focused on heat generation ventilation, and cooling refrigeration systems. You'll learn about installation, operation, maintenance, units, parts, basic controls, functions, applications, safety standards, and codes. You could come away with two certificates. Students also get an opportunity to take the Occupational Safety Health Act OSHA Level 10 certification while they're here in class. That can help them get placed in many different fields, not just heating and air conditioning. Um, in the springtime, we'll also take the Environmental Protection Agency test, EPA certification to handle refrigerants. Learning these skills can open the door to an in-demand job with good pay. Probably go into this field for more residential stuff, which is more like the units on the side of your house is more like these ones here and these ones here. We strongly recommend you consider this industry. Tremendous amount of job opportunities and a lot of room for advancement. In an emergency, every second counts. You can be part of the life-saving work people depend on every day. After I get certified, I'm gonna go be an EMT at a fire station. And then the hands-on skills are learning things such as how to treat a heart attack, respiratory emergencies, how to deliver a baby, how to treat somebody who's in insulin shock. So they're learning all the things that would be needed in an emergency situation. The Emergency Medical Technician Program is recognized by the Indiana Department of Homeland Security, which allows you to become a certified EMT. With that, you can begin your career immediately after high school graduation. I'm going to work my way up to be a paramedic and then a, uh, an RN. It's a dual credit course. If you get national certification, you can go anywhere in the country to work as an EMT. The beauty of that is, is for the students, is, is that some of them want to go out of state to colleges. So going out of state to college, this is a national, so they can work as an EMT wherever they want to go. And if you want to stay closer to home. We've got uh, a cooperation with some of the ambulance services in this area. They'll hire them immediately when they get out of school so they can have gainful employment with full insurance benefits, vacation time, and everything. It's just a good way to start our future.
Well, I'm learning pieces of the computer that is inside, how they work inside and out, and components and how to use certain tools. Precise and detailed work is taking place in this classroom, which is more like a workshop. It draws in tech-savvy students. I try to address it as aspiring technology professionals. And those curious about computers. A desire to figure things out, to problem solve, to troubleshoot, and just to inquire. And inquiry uh, is a big thing uh, as it pertains to technology. The Computer Tech Support and Computer Networking course focuses on the fundamentals of designing, setting up, and configuring computer networks also learn how to assemble and configure a computer, install and configure operating systems, wire networks, and routers and switches. Uh, these students can be network engineers, they can be um, desktop support, they can be mass deployment, they can be uh, production, they can be research and development uh, for, for various corporations, your distributors, your manufacturers. Um, and again, it's even project management. They can go into the business side of it, but still you need the foundation of understanding to be able to be a part of the application of it. This dual credit course provides the first steps that can lead to a collegiate or a two-year program or certifications. Whatever role you choose, it begins with understanding how it all comes together and apart. That can be challenging, but also rewarding. Technology is not, is not something that they should be afraid of. It's something they should be open-minded about and, and something that they can pursue the Criminal Justice Dual Credit course is designed to provide basic fundamentals, knowledge, and skills necessary to enter the criminal justice field. Robotics courses at Pike are growing. You'll learn exciting skills that tie directly into the 1018 Robotics Club. In Robotics Design and Innovation, you'll build robots and design, program, and test innovative technological designs related to robotic systems. The Industrial Automation and Robotics Pathway provides fundamentals in industrial robotics, basic programming, and operations. And here are even more reasons to be Pike Proud. The graduation rate for students who attend Career and Technical Education, or CTE courses at Pike High School, was 98%. Students in CTE courses scored above the state average in ISTEP Plus Math and English. 100% of students identified as CTE concentrator students, which is six or more credits in a program of study, are continuing in post-secondary education, advanced training, military service, or employment in preparation for CTE occupations. In 2019, 80% of eligible students received the certification that they attempted. Hike High School also offers business IT, which includes accounting and finance, marketing and management, computer science, and interactive media. And in family and consumer science, fashion, child development, educator, nutrition and wellness, adult roles and responsibilities, and human social services. And in Project Lead the Way, engineering, manufacturing, and health careers, including biomed, human body systems, and animal science. Now, let's go. Now that you have your career all planned out, or maybe not quite yet, it's time to get registered in the career course of your choice. Get a complete list of pathways and courses from your counselor. When you're ready to take your first steps on your career pathway, we'll help you chart the course. At Pike High School, your future is waiting. Ready, set, go.